good. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> Thank you. Um, how did you get into the business? I actually got the business after one of my girlfriends suggested it. I was in this job um, in an office, and I just wasn't passionate about it. I was looking to make a change, and I wanted to find something really flexible. So she knew some girls in the industry. She thought I'd be a good fit. I thought she was joking, um, but... You know, I like took a chance and I went for it, and I'm having so much fun with it. Uh, what aspect surprised you the most about it? Um, what surprised you the most? I think just how serious I would end up taking it. Like initially, when I got into it, that would just be something fun and not really like a career move. And I just found that I was enjoying it so much, and I wanted to keep pursuing it and actually pursue other projects and like keep it moving and like build a brand. And that really surprised me about. It. I didn't think about going into it that you could like be your own boss. <laughs> I was super excited. I couldn't believe it um, when they called my name. It was just really exciting um, and just really, really rewarding. It's great to get that recognition from the industry among so many other really talented girls. So I'm super happy about it. Um, is there any scene that you've shot so far that stands out in your mind? And um, you know, I'm always trying to push myself and, and try new things and, and become a stronger performer. But I would say I recently did a movie for Evil Angel called Bikini Clad Come Sluts 2. It's a boy-boy-girl, and um, it's just really raw and edgy and dirty. And I felt like I really pushed myself on that scene. I was really happy with how it came out. Measure B. I am against Measure B. And I actually just did a movie. I volunteered um, and I did a movie for Zero Tolerance. It's going to be coming out. It's called Measure X. And all the proceeds are going to help fight against Measure B. Um, but basically, I just feel like it's a violation of our rights. Like, I feel like as an adult, and we're all consenting adults, that we should be able to choose what we do with our bodies. I initially got into it just for fitness, um, just to work out, and my coach just thought I was really good, and he thought I should start competing, and so a year into my training, I started competing, and I don't know, I just love it. <laughs> what do you enjoy most about it? What do I enjoy most? Um, I think just um, the com like competitive drive that comes out of me, and just seeing how you can go from day one, like when you start like your training camp and see how far you push your body and see how far like your endurance and, and the end result, obviously, if you get that win, is just a really, really great feeling. Uh, who's your favorite fighter and why? My favorite fighter is John Jones. He's really young, he's super talented and I think that he's just like a natural athlete. Like some people are just naturally gifted in their sport and I feel like that is him he's just like a natural athlete and he's really great to watch uh, what do you, are you a fan of ronda rousey i am a fan of ronda rousey uh i think she's pretty sexy and i think she's gonna win her next match <laughs> I think it's awesome. Um, it's been a long time coming, and definitely women in MMA. It's not as big as the men, but it's growing and it's getting notoriety. And I think it's great that they're allowing girls in, in the UFC. Uh, what's your type of guy? My type of guy, um, I don't know, a sexy guy. <laughs> um, I like really like people with common interests as me, and I'm like super into fitness. So like athletic guys. Um, healthy, I don't know, funny. <laughs> uh, what do you like to do in your spare time? In my spare time, like I said before, I'm like a fitness freak. Like I'm either CrossFit or at my fight gym um, or I'm working. So not that exciting, but I have a lot of fun with it. All right, any closing words? Um, you can find me at Adriana Luna XXX on my Twitter to find out all my um, updates, everything that's going on with me and in the industry.